we were asked to find the 74th percentile for the following data. There is more than one method for determining a percentile. In our class, we'll use the method outlined below, where we let k equal the kth percentile, which in our case, because we are looking for the 74th percentile, k equals 74, i equals the index, which is also referred to as the ranking or position of a given data value, and n is equal to the total number of data values. Because we have 23 data values, n equals 23. And now to find the 74th percentile, the first step is to order the data from least to greatest. In our case though, looking at the table, the data values are already in order from least to greatest in rows. Step two, we calculate i, which is equal to k divided by 100 times the quantity n plus one. So i is equal to k divided by 100 is 74 divided by 100, and then times the quantity n plus one, which in our case gives us the quantity 23 plus one. Simplifying, 74 divided by 100 is equal to 0.74, 23 plus one is equal to 24, and this product is equal to 17.76. Now we know i is equal to 17.76. Next, if i is an integer, then the kth percentile is the data value in the ith position. But in our case, i is 17.76, which is not an integer, and therefore this does not apply. If i is not an integer, then we round i up and round i down to the nearest integers. And then we average the data values in these two positions. So if we round i down to the nearest integer, which we will call i sub down, we have 17. If we round i up to the nearest integer, which we'll call i sub up, we would have 18. Which means the 74th percentile is equal to the average of the two data values in the 17th and 18th positions. So going back over to the table, we have five, 10, 15, 70 is in the 16th position, and therefore 82 is in the 17th position, and 84 is in the 18th position, which means the 74th percentile is the average of these two data values, which means P sub 74 the 74th percentile is equal to the quantity 82 plus 84 divided by two, which is equal to 83. The 74th percentile is equal to 83. And remember, 74% of the data values are less than or equal to the 74th percentile, which means in our case, 74% of the data values are less than or equal to 83. I hope you found this helpful.